So first, I want to just draw a distinction between explicit costs and implicit costs. And this is a rather short distinction. Explicit costs basically means that basically means that money is changing hands. These are your actual expenses. So for instance, your tuition cost at the university for this class is eh, about 600 bucks or so. But there's also the implicit cost. Which is measured by what you could be doing instead. Which we essentially call your opportunity cost. And for this, it would be the time that you spend it would be the time that you spend in class versus doing something else. Not just your time, but basically you can only do one thing at a time. So by doing, by attending class, you can't do something else. But being in college, you can't work those extra hours, right? Even if you're working and going to school at the same time, you're still going to not be able to work as many hours. So those are your implicit costs, are your opportunity costs. Now, what we essentially do then is we create distinctions between those when we um, start to talk about um, our economic profit versus our accounting profit, which is what we'll do in um, part two.